What's poppin', guys? Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified of all my up and coming videos. And lastly, thank you for watching. Now, let's get into it. I thought Ted stole all your money and you ain't got another hit in you. You can't, he took your youth, gave them whores and hound dogs to you and let them get you sick. And now you ain't got enough energy to even stand up in the studio to write a hit. Don't get mad at me. I love you see, W.D., I fuck with you. You cook me collard greens, you know, chicken, even though it tastes like wood. Have you ever went over a friend's house to eat and the food just ain't no good? You see, the macaroni sauce and the peas all mush, and your chicken tastes like wood and cocaine because you was snorting the whole time, not washing your hands. Fuck, nigga, I didn't even want to eat nothing at your house. But I didn't tell nobody that. <laughs> I'm dead, y'all. I done fell out. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm back alive, bitch. <laughs> the death angel following you. It ain't following me. Uh -uh. <laughs> Around here looking like the Grim Reaper, but you trying to roast me. Lord have mercy. I wish Trick Daddy would have just stayed out of that. Around here looking like fucking Dineva feet. <laughs> you have been near death experiences every day. <laughs> but you tried to roast me. I wish you would have just stayed out of this. Looking like fucking Dineva feet. <laughs> Get order. Let's talk about the order. Just handle it and da 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 I really don't know what to say to you other than I hit you up a long time ago, but don't you ever in your 49 years of living, you bastard hound looking bitch, try to come for me. You is not the baddest bitch. You do not look better than me, bitch. You do not have more hits than me. All you do is try to make friends with bitches in the industry. You just a bed bug. If I'm a roach, you a bed bug. And you know how bed bugs do to people's bodies. You've been infecting people's beds for many, many, many motherfucking years, huh? You bastard hound looking bitch. Don't you ever try to come for the queen. You not the baddest, you the saddest hoe. You are the original Cardi B. Cardi B just came in the game and she done won all kind of awards, hoe. You done been in the game for 17 years and you ain't won nothing but a disease. <laughs> Since no nigga ain't never gave you nothing, I giving you an iodine dish to clean that sour puss because it ain't been cleaned in years. Some feminine deodorant spray because your pussy been sour. You been fucked out and fucked through. You need to spray some of this spray on that stank ass pussy and shed with Kate Michelle because her shit stank too. Some mouth wash because you been sucking dick and pussy. I know your mouth is rotten and corroded. Put some of this mouth wash on your pussy and spray a little bit on the sponge when you wipe your ass. And some feminine body wash. All of these things is for you to Take care of that sour food. Since then. That's it. You rub that pile of red ants 
God been. Cardi, you are being charged with not being able to write, rap, or speak no English, marrying a cheating ass nigga you just met and having a baby nine months later to secure the bag, only to fuck him before your six week checkup and fighting strippers in the club after. I wore the t shirt. Who gives a fuck what y'all think about it? I don't. Next question. Food stamp fraud. See, that's why y'all need to stay off the internet because, baby, I've never been convicted of food stamp fraud. I've never been eligible for food stamp. I wish I could get some stamps. Do you have some stamps for sale, bitch? Because I would love to have me a crab board tomorrow. You got some stamps for sale because I buy them, bitch. Do you have any stamps for sale? Let me give you an address so you can mail me that motherfucking ghetto EBT card so we can go get us some shrimps and craw craw a crawfish tomorrow, bitch. If you know anybody that has any food stamps for sale, call your CEO at Gmail. Send me the number and I'm going to send you an address so you can send me that card. Because we love to throw fish fries and parties and crab balls, bitch. Send me that EBT food stamp because down there in New York, y'all get more stamps than we do here in the South. You motherfucking struggles down there. You bitch get about 800 for two children. Send me that card. drop my grandchildren. I don't want nobody keeping my children or my grandchildren. So I don't understand how these bitches are so comfortable with letting all these motherfuckers keep their children. Then they got saltines keeping their children. Well, Kim got a black woman keep a hug. Look at North. North looking scared. Look at the baby up there. They don't, what y'all think about these bitches having all these children and letting the nannies raise them? Who y'all think... What y'all thinking about that? Anyway, Tokyo Tony talk shit. They sent these pictures in and say Tokyo was saying that the nannies was doing all kind of shit to the children. As we see, they with the nannies. They look a little safe on here, but we're gonna are we are, are we ready to read Tokyo's book? I mean, if you're gonna put the book out, Tokyo, just put it out. Ain't no sense you keep threatening, you know, talk about what you're gonna tell and that you looked in the medicine cabinet and seen monostat and all kind of motherfucking uh, uh, herpes simplex one, two, and three medications in the medicine cabinet. What you doing in the women's medicine cabinet? Did you did you take a picture? See, that's why you can't let holes in your heart. She don't be up and down my motherfucking timeline roasting. I don't give a fuck about your feelings or opinion, bitch. I don't even read that shit. I hit the delete button. That's what you need to know. And for you bitches that have been on my timeline, I let you voice your opinion for a limited time and then it's blockity blockity, bitch. Because you don't have no motherfucking opinion in the Queen's Court. That's what they need to understand. If I was irrelevant, you wouldn't be here. When you don't like something, you don't follow it. You don't look at it. Girl, bottom line is we're dealing with facts. You already know I have more than one song. You already know I got to hit that stick like grits. It may came out in 2000, but it's 2017, and it's still getting the same response that it got 20 years ago. Goodbye, bitch. Until you get a hit like that, you can't say nothing to me. Don't address me. Get like me. Case closed. Next case. Bitch, I got to turn into a gospel for you church-going-ass niggas to hear. Respect me. It's your damn beat, Wendy. With your puss ass. I can't stand you. I say, what the fuck going on? <laughs> you are being charged with photoshopping prosthetic feet during your photo shoot. You wanted us to believe that those were your feet just like you wanted us to believe that you wasn't hiding the cooter brown when you fell out last Halloween. Trick or treat, bitch. <laughs> Did you see the Barbie Dream video? Did you not see the puppets in the video? Okay, did you not see the colors in the video? So was Hype Williams looking at next caller and said, Ooh, I want some muffins too. I want some muffins too. How about we get a lot of muffins? You know, I want the Queen's Court too. I want the Queen's Court too. How about it's Queen Radio? I want my album named Queen. Your album called Queen Don't Come. I'm going to name my album Queen. She copied you with a damn I'm like, I had, I said, really? I just brushed to the side. I'm like, what the fuck? She Bitch, na name me one lie. One thing I'm not gonna do is lie on the motherfucker. Everything I say is edge in stone, bitch. Even my opinion, most of the time, that's right. But the only thing I'm ever gonna deal with is motherfucking facts, bitch. And the facts in this case, one fact you got right, I don't the fuck like you. There's nowhere. 
You're going to get your do girl. You're going to get the dummy. You're going to get Shekana. You're going to get the pawn to do your dirty work. Why you sent Shekana up there by herself? Why didn't you go with her? Why didn't you come with her? You know, you know she's the fall guy. You know she's the do girl. I've been telling y'all she's been the dummy. She's been the jester. That's why I ain't never really care for her because I don't like weak bitches. I don't like weakness. I don't like dumb shit. I don't like it. I never liked that. I, I, she always been just the dumb girl to me. Okay? No hate. This is just the truth. Don't get mad at the truth and don't get mad at the gag. If you're able to sit in a gag... So ain't no sense you worrying about the queen's hair because the queen's hair is all the way down to my feet. Grow you some, bitch.